We're going to turn out of that breaking news overnight. Novak Djokovic has won the battle to stay in Australia after his visa had been revoked over his vaccination status. It's still not clear if the world's top-ranked player will be able to defend his Australian Open title. Will Reeve has all the latest. Good morning, Will. Good morning, George. If court proceedings were tennis, this would be a multi-stroke fifth set rally back and forth with the stakes as high as can be. It's Novak Djokovic and his lawyers against the Australian government. Djokovic won this point, but it's not over. This morning, a chaotic scene in Melbourne, Australia. Police struggling to hold back a crowd surrounding what they believe to be the car of Novak Djokovic, leaving his lawyer's office. The melee coming after a federal judge upheld Djokovic's appeal to stay in the country to defend his title in next week's Australian Open, after the federal government revoked his travel visa over vaccine requirements. The judge ordering Djokovic's passport and belongings returned immediately. But attorneys for the Australian government said the Minister for Immigration was considering re-canceling the tennis star's visa, threatening to restart proceedings. A decision to cancel Djokovic's visa again would result in a three-year ban from entering Australia. It's been a week of winding drama for the world's number one player down under, as he stands on the precipice of winning a record 21st Grand Slam title. The saga began early last week when Djokovic revealed he had received an exemption permission to play in the Australian Open. That set off a political firestorm in Australia, which has some of the strictest COVID-related entry requirements in the world. It's our rule. <laughs> That's it. No jab, no break. Upon landing in Melbourne, Djokovic was detained for hours at the airport by Australian border forces, who deemed his exemption insufficient to enter the country. His visa ultimately cancelled. Djokovic appealed the ruling and was detained at the Park Hotel quarantine facility until his appeal could be reviewed Monday. Djokovic was released from that quarantine facility and immediately went to training for the Australian Open. His brother held a press conference that Novak had been expected at. He said, Novak is free. I'm very happy that justice exists. Guys. All right, Will. Thank you. Thank you. Again, he described in the beginning the back and forth. I'm just waiting to see what happens next. Because it's not quite over yeah. just mm -hmm. yet. Is he going to we'll play? We'll see. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.